gem of neck food. Local lady sobbing. Maybe I did a bad thing. Do so humans have to die and spare any humans with a food service background? What a day, Grim. What a day. Let us go over your conduct first. Yep. Good. I see the correct amount of profiles. Today seems to be in order. Thank you. Anyway, Grim, five days you have been with us. How does it feel to make the difficult choices? Um... Grim, take this seriously. We are here to save the humans from themselves and hold the chaos at bay. Yeah, right. But think of the humans. Do you think our office is the appropriate way to deal with them? Um. I don't 
don't know. Is there another way? Perhaps I... No, never mind. I have not found a way around the tradition. And I have been here a long time. Well, if you, if you reckon it's right. This control over all the lives, unbeknownst to the humans, do you not consider it unethical to make the choices you make? Um. Yeah, it's your rules. True enough. One must be in charge. The others are there to follow. Oh, if everyone's in charge, nothing gets done. The office is perennial and venerated. Eons we have spent designing the appropriate methods and strategies. We know what we are doing. That's good to hear. Oh, I do apologize for taking up so much of your time. Before you go, are there any questions you would like to ask me? Um... How much of they? An astute observation. You see, Grim. Yep. Our office does not operate on information about biological backgrounds or genetic composition. Everyone you assess is simply human, after all, excluding any monumental error in normal procedure. I guess you're right. They are all human. The bottom line is that the humans end up on your desk and that you must follow the rules. That is what I was born for. Anything else? Um. seen about age, but we'll see. Ah, the children. They are a special case for a different set of departments to deal with. You will not find any yourself. Okay. Um, I guess that's good to know. Anything else? Um, okay. Oh, <clears throat> not at all. Yep, not a thing. What about it? Humans have some free will, sure. They can make a variety of choices. Yet what matters is that they cannot escape the inevitable. No one can do further. The life-threatening situations that bring them onto your desk a result of their own deeds and decisions. I guess it is their fault. Then there are some highly complex calculations, factors and aspects that influence the situation. But that is just a bit over your pay grade, so do not worry about it. Then give me information. <laughs> Anything else? Let's see about that. Absolutely. All living beings have to be processed after the end. No escape. Can we process the cat? Even plants. Yes, there is a department for plants. Do not ask about the plant department. What about the plant department? Anything else? Um... Unliving things, building and such. Technically, uh, kind of, I guess. Ruins are like a type of dead. But then again, they often feel so alive. I guess since they're still there. Hmm. I must ponder. This topic is a bit too abstract for now. Let us table it. Yep. Anything else? Um. It is all I can think of, apparently. Right. It has been enlightening. I bid you a good night. See you tomorrow.